spiritual warfare that has been released a few months now keys for spiritual warfare right here on amazon you can just look for um uh, keys for spiritual War- warfare a book from dr odisman of course you can go to my personal website dr odisman.com you get an audio version only available on my website and also you can also get an uh, ebook on my website on amazon you can get a physical book or an ebook amen so you can go right there you can go to any one of my websites information will be on your screen you can also get it at kingston bookshop you can get it at all of our church branches and of course that all important number call that number and we'll be happy to give you some information how we get it and you'll be able to get your copies in fontana pharmacies island wide God bless you. This is your pastor, Reverend Dr. Otis Manning. Another week, and um, for those who've been following, this, as you see, I've made you a promise, and I'm trying my best to keep up with it. Sun is going down, and as you can still see, no roof. Let's go. So good, and um, we're in the building behind me, as you can see, the uh, extended version of what's happening. So we're in the sanctuary, and um, what's going to be the sanctuary actually? And so we're still doing renovations work renovation work on um, the physical building and um, we thank God for where things are going thus far thank you for all the folks who've been praying and for those who have been uh, deciding you know I want to be a part of this listen as I did make a, a promise to you you're going to be seeing a lot of the administration of what's happening past and current and of course we want every person who's been watching make sure you share make sure you follow there's a lot you guys are missing on in the week because um, uh, 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 we've been doing work on Sunday night every Sunday night we're live on Facebook and YouTube and um, uh, uh, you guys if you're not following you could be missing so watch this there's some information below please make sure you hit follow and follow us on our broadcast digitally is where everything is going and so everybody has to go a little bit digital and so we are there please if you hear a noise outside because we are literally um, as I shared with you earlier there's no roof where we're working inside no roof and by uh, next two weeks or so uh, the roof should have been partially completed or something like that all right so wherever you're watching from always a privilege to have you and there's going to be some ministration this week again I made your promise and so we'll be sharing that with you but we need your support we need you to be praying for us number one I need some people say you know I'm gonna be praying for this ministry that God's will be done number two amen we don't just need the prayers but we need some people to financially send forth and give 10,000 5,000 whatever 20,000 30 whatever the Lord speaks to your heart that's between you and God whatever gift the Lord want to speak to you what is the matter of God all I have is two thousand dollars how can I give it I'm gonna make sure I'll give you some information right now not just that but there are some numbers these numbers will be present right throughout this program these numbers will be on your screens i want you to call these numbers call this number i have a gift how can i get it to the man of god not just that but i want to be praying with you and i've made a commitment that every person who's been calling to give a gift i want them to record your name your number and so i can give you a call so i want you to call man of god i want to give a gift into this house into this ministry and i want to pray with you and pray for you and as you send forth your seed i want to believe god with you no Nothing is impossible to them that believe and we've taken the step of faith to build our HQ that's right our headquarters um, for this uh, ministry and so we're doing that and so your gift is going to assist us along the way so many people being saved transformed today five persons got baptized and we're grateful unto God for that amen and um, weekly we're seeing people coming to know the Lord Jesus Christ your gift amen is gonna help us to build right there behind this wall is um the pool we're building the pool behind this wall the baptismal pool whatever gift you are giving i mean we're thankful guess what i'm going to take you into some videos and you're going to see what god has been doing in this ministry let's go
Hi, God bless you. This is your pastor, Reverend Dr. Otis Manning, and it's a pleasure to be here with you. I stand here to celebrate, amen, the wonderful things that God has been doing over the years. This year, we have marked five years in ministry, and I want to take you to a journey through uh, our five years as a ministry, um, and established, and the miracle power of God that has happened. Onika. Onika went to the hospital and Onika, they diagnosed you with what? They said ligaments were swollen and inflamed. Um, I was still feeling the pains over my left and right side. Mm -hmm. And then um, Pastor prayed for me. Mm -hmm. And then this, the pain uh, moved from my right. And then he prayed again and then it moved, removed from my left side. And when I sit down, I feel the pain um, going away gradually. And when I sit down, as feel but the, the area and I didn't feel anything. God bless you. You always give me what you want God to do for you. Where's oil? Give me oil. I admire your faith. You have faith. Just keep pushing. You have faith. And not because you come just now. I know you have faith. I know. How do you know, man of God? I know. I know. May God do it. I've seen you take you've you've you are crazy like me. There's faith inside of you. You have faith. I am proving your faith. Believe God. May God do it for you. Amen. I'm responsible for paying my school fee, right? So when the building fund thing came up, I said, Lord, I want to give, but I have my school fee to pay. So I'm going to give my school fee if you take care of school for me. So I did not wait for an answer. I just went right ahead and gave. So every money I've gotten that was supposed to be my school fee, I bring it to church and I give it as building fund. So Sunday, sir said to me that I have faith and I should believe God. When he said believe God, that was it for me. I'm saying, okay, Lord. All right. Monday now, I got up and when I was getting ready to go down to the site, I just stopped and I began to cry and I was just thanking God and I was worshiping. So after I went home the Monday night, light is gone. So I went to bed early. I got a dream where I was testifying and telling Sir my testimony. So I said, okay, in the morning, Tuesday morning, when light come back, I go and check my phone. And then as light come, I check my phone and there was an email saying I got a grant of X amount of money to pay my school fee. But she sold her school fee. That's exactly what I did. Huh? It still couldn't pay my school fee. That's my philosophy. What I had couldn't pay her. She said, watch it. Now the money she has, there's the grant she got, money is left over for your next year. Yes, sir. So... So, <laughs> so she finished the school year owing. Now the school year is finished them owing you. Oh, and no late fee had no late fee added. And no what? No late fee added. How much is a late fee? Well, it's ten thousand up. Per what? Per after the month finish. Uh, ten thousand every month? Yeah. And you didn't pay for how many months? Two months. Two two months. Months. So that's about $30,000 extra upon the school fee. Those are not on it. Plus, the school now owe you money. That sounds like a God. Good afternoon, church. Afternoon. Um, I was telling Pastor last night that Monday, I decided not to go to the studio, but I decided that I'm going to be on the site where the new church is building up. So the phone rang. One of my boss said, um, 70,000 at the union for you, you know. I said, wait. Wait, you said 70? So I said, Pastor, this is good. This is really good. We just show up on the side and just start. And I... <laughs> 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 
Alléluia. Your name is what? Your name is what? Sorry? Your name is what? Joy. Eh? Joy. I saw her coming this morning and I felt sorry for her. Because I see her. You don't reach them the age they yet. Jump. Come. 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 Touch your toe. Look, jump. How is that? It's a little. Huh? A little more pain. A little bit more? Yes. All right, so most of it is gone? Yes, sir. Good, let's get the rest out. Good. Yeah, you're too young for that. So I'm like, what's wrong with that girl? I saw her face coming through the door. I said, no, nah, sir. You're loud. Yes, how is that? Just a little bit left. Where? Father, I speak. Father, oh sweet Holy Spirit. Jump. Jump. And that's joy. It. That's you now. Run. Good. 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 No more hollow man. How is that? Thank you, Jesus. No more pain. You are free. Let's clap our hands for Jesus. <laughs> What's your name? Nidia. I met Nidia Thursday in Clarendon. And she said, Pastor. Say, say, you know me, mommy? So, Nidia is going to tell us a story. So, Nidia had, um, have a most amazing testimony. I really didn't remember her. Go ahead. Good afternoon, church. In 2017, I had an accident on December 2nd, and my jawbone was broke, my wrist and my elbow, and I came to church and pastor prayed for me, and I went back to the doctor, and he said that I'm yielding fast, and I had to do surgery, because if I don't do it, I'm going to forget about my jogging. So I did surgery, and after one month and two weeks, um, I went back to school. I looked normal, like nothing did happen to me. The curls come off of my hands, and yeah. All right, I want to hear what you say. When I met Nidia, that's right, she couldn't talk. They do something to her mouth. They, what did they do? They wired my mouth together. They wired her mouth together. She had a broken jaw. Anybody remember her? You remember that now? When she said that, that's when I remembered. So they wired her mouth so she couldn't talk. You could have said something to her teeth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's how she would have to talk. Because she had teeth in, but they wired her mouth together. I've never seen that one in my life. So they wired her mouth so that her jaw could be healed. So when she came for prayer, that's 2017, long time ago. That's how she was. So when I saw her in Clarendon, she was, of course, looking different, looking different, looking better, and she's quite grown a lot too. I couldn't know her. So she's glad and happy for what God has done for her. Her jaw bound is perfectly working. Her hands, I did not remember about the hands. You have two hands that break? Wrist and elbow? I did not remember nothing about that. I just remember the jawbone. So your wrist and your elbow was broken. Yes. And God have done a wonderful work. Let's clap for Jesus. The world has been affected by COVID, but we want to show you some things we've done the last two years. Look at the glory of God. Let's go. 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 Yes! Who's Everald? You are Everald? The Lord wants you to turn. Give him your heart. Give him your heart. 
the Lord God of glory have come to find you tonight if you take it lightly it is on your own shoulder I rest the case two gunmen came for me and shot up my car only one shot flew through and penetrated and I came out of the hospital the same Wednesday last week Wednesday I've always said to myself that I'll never, never ever get married because I'm going to trust. Ever since I came in his, his kingdom, there's so many things that I said never, even praising the Lord right now. But, Aniana Hardy, will you marry me? Asha K. Brown, will you marry me? Will you marry me? Jesus, here I am with my uncle Jesus. Preserve my life. Awesome and mighty is your name. We say, is the Lord God of vengeance. To whom you've seen what God has been doing in this house. The purpose of this ad is to ask for your help, to seek your help. We're embarking on a brand new project. I believe in my spirit and my heart. The Lord has given us the grace. It's time for us to purchase our own building. We have purchased one building this year. Let me show it to you. Brand new building we purchased. Well, not brand new, but new for us. That purchased in Montego Bay for Montego Bay Church. And now for the headquarters in Kingston, which we are right there, we are acquiring land and the property of very own home building. You can be a major part of this, helping us to raise a hundred million Jamaican dollars for acquisition of land and properties. There's going to be some developmental costs that are going to be associated with the development of this property. But at least for now, we want to go ahead for the purchasing of these properties. I understand a lot is happening. I understand the dilemmas and all the things that's happening globally. But there is a people of not bow their knees to be out. There's people that God are predestined to be a part of this. A few years ago, the Lord visited me in a dream and he told me, not only was he giving me the parishes of Jamaica, but he told me he's giving me the wedges or the helpers to help me to succeed. So I know that there are some people the Lord have granted for this house that are sent to help to keep doors open to open doors and i believe that god is selecting people who are watching this program at this time you are part of this whatever you have whatever you can give to assist us in the work we've been on these we've been on television we've been on radio we've been doing magazines we've been doing books we've been doing our food pantry i'll show you a clip of that right there That's your son behind so what i didn't say to you i've spoken to my partners we'll be sponsoring your son one year school school fee i think you have 300 and how much is it 389 we're covering one year scholarship for him for this year god i put it in our hearts and listen we are paying her entire school fee for her the mother told him i'm pulling you from school you have to go to high trust NTA. you don't have to be pulled from school any longer the lord has heard your cry you are going to school for the full year I want to announce to you in my hand is our first motor vehicle and somebody is about to smile this is the key to your vehicle it's downstairs we declare it blessed our books been doing wonderful being blessing to so many people books right there and i want you to be a partner in this for any contribution you can. Here are the account details. If you're watching from a smartphone, just go ahead and swipe and get a picture. Or you can write down all these details. We are believing God for people to stand with us in this time because God have called us to do his work. And I believe he will appoint people to be a blessing in this. There are people God is going to speak to your spirit. And then there are some people you are in a place of need. Even as Elijah said to the woman, bake me a cake first. She said, I just have a little bit. And he said to her, but out of your little, give me first. There are some people, this is not for me. This is not for my own doing. This is for the kingdom's sake. And the Lord has given you 
you the grace to give. Whatever it is, information is going to be on the screens. As you give, shall be given back with measures. Press down, shaking together, running over. Shall men give to your bosom. I'll be praying over your seeds. Make sure we get your information that I'll be praying with you and for you. And trust in God that he will grant you the profit's reward. God bless you. I pray you've been blessed by what you saw and that you've been encouraged. Listen, week after week for the last few years, we've been here, we've been here on this channel, serving the general public. And for years, we've been here just doing the work of an evangelist. And there comes a time that the Lord allows an opportunity like this one that we could have entered into a purchase agreement to purchase our own building for our Kingston branch. We did so for Montego Bay. Now we're doing that for Kingston branch. And uh, let me take this opportunity to invite you, by the way, um, to Montego Bay's church. We have a church there in Montego Bay, we have a church there in Clarendon, we have a church there in New York, in Queens. And so these branches are wide open for access. The numbers can be on your screen. As I stated before, numbers can be on your screen. You can call for all the information. You can visit the website, drwoodismanning.com, godforthemidstreet.org. Information will be on your screen. And you'll be able to see all that's been happening I mean, with our branches. I mean, Denby in Clarendon is there on Sunday at 8.30. Uh, Montego Bay is there uh, every Sunday at 9.30. There's weekly service in Montego Bay at um, uh, Wednesdays at 6. And of course, in Kingston, there is weekly service Tuesday and Friday. And um, Tuesdays and Friday, Friday night, 6 o'clock. Tuesday night, 6 o'clock. And uh, Tuesday day, uh, fasting at 11 o'clock. In Denby, Clarendon also on a Thursday at 11 o'clock. And so you can call for the information, all the information are available. And of course, you can visit us and um, time to time on different branches. But listen, God has been doing something amazing in this church. If you've never visited, hey, you're missing out. You need to come on out. Amen. We're going to be at 130 Reddles Road until the end of January. Once again, 130 Reddles Road until the end of January, February. Look up again. We are moving in this place. Roof. <laughs> no roof. Go be roof. Don't worry yourself. But we're moving. God's willing. All being well. We're moving by the grace of Jesus Christ. We're moving here and starting this spot of ground for February. I want you to meet me for worship, for, for the revival in power, the miracle working power. Starting February, we're going to be right here. And um, we're going to be having our big bashment right here. Every January, I normally have an event more than likely. I'm going to leave that event until February, until we move into this new facility. More than likely, we're going to kick it off right here and uh, allow the presence of God to do what God do best. Amen. Work miracles. And so wherever you're watching this from, amen, I want to believe God. I want to pray with you and pray for you. I want to pray that whatever you're going through, you're sick in your body, God is able to heal you. You're physically bound or challenged. God is able to restore you. I get testimonies, amen, and I'm going to ask Felicia to put a testimony from the book. By the way, if you don't have a copy of the book, you need to get a copy of your book. You need to get a copy of the book, Key for Spiritual Warfare. And let's look on this testimony. Testify of the goodness of Almighty God. I have a brother some months ago he was diagnosed with cancer of the stomach. He got a copy of the key for spiritual warfare and after he read the book and three failed attempts and surgery. One morning while brushing his teeth he started coughing and to his surprise up come the cancer. Today my brother is cancer free because of the key for spiritual warfare. Persons listening or watching, you too can be set free. Just get your own copy. Trust God because he can do the same for you. All right, I, I know you just saw that testimony, how God moved into that man's life. He had cancer. God delivered him. So many testimonies like that. How people put a book on the belly, book on, book on the free. Crazy testimony. But God did it. And so listen, I mean, whatever is wrong with you, you're an alcoholic, you're a drug addict, you're, you're struggling with, 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 you know, maintenance problem, financial problems, any issue, anxiety, God is able. Father, I pray for one and I pray for all. 
Those who are believing for a miracle, give them a miracle. Somebody believing to get pregnant who is married, give them that miracle. Somebody believing God for favor, grant them that favor. I release access and supernatural answers to prayer. I declare that the dimensions be open and I release increase. May the Spirit of the living God begin to work and testify for these who are believing. I break the barriers of hell. I break the diabolic assignment and I declare open doors. Ephrata. And I speak life. God, Jehovah, do it for these people. Do it for them. I release answers to prayer and I release favor. God, I bless them as they watch. And I declare your grace in Jesus' name. Amen and amen. I'm going to be trying my best. Amen. This week, Thursday, I'll be in Clarendon with you. This week, Thursday, by the grace of the Lord Jesus Christ, I'll be in Denby Clarendon with you. This week, Thursday, by God's grace, I'll be live in Denby Clarendon. Make sure you make your dates. Make your dates. And by God's grace, the 23rd, amen, just before Christmas, amen, come for your Christmas presents. I'll lay my hand and I'll be praying with you, prophetically declaring whatever the Lord will release into my spirit. I want to make sure I see you on the 23rd. I'll be there with you by the grace of God in Clarendon. Mount, you could be, I'll let you know what's happening. But January, definitely going to be doing something big in March. I'm looking forward to seeing you by the grace of God, that is, for the event I just mentioned. I'm looking forward to seeing you. Numbers are on the screen. Call. Make your contribution. Whatever the Lord is putting in your spirit, we're, we're believing with you, we're trusting God with you, and we want to pray for you. I want to pray for you. When you call to make a gift, send it. tell them, the man of God says he wants to pray with me. I'll give you a number at a later date, and I'll call you back. That's good. I bless you. I speak life testimonies may favor be yours in jesus name and of course we want every person who's been watching make sure you share make sure you follow there's a lot you guys are missing on in the week because um uh, uh, uh we've been doing work on sunday night every sunday night we're live on facebook and youtube and um uh, uh, you guys, if you're not following, you're going to be missing. So watch this. There's some information below. Please make sure you hit follow and follow us on our broadcast. Digitally is where everything is going. And so everybody has to go a little bit digital. And so we are there. Next week, same place, same time, this same program. See you. Bigger. Keys for Spiritual Warfare that has been released a few months now. Keys for Spiritual Warfare right here on Amazon. You can just look for um, uh, Keys for Spiritual War Warfare, a book from Dr. Odisman. Of course, you can get go to my personal website, drodisman.com. You get an audio version only available on my website, and also you can also get an uh, ebook on my website on Amazon. You can get a physical book or an ebook. Amen. So you can go right there. You can go to any one of my websites. Information will be on your screen. You can also also get it at Kingston Bookshop. You can get it at all of our church branches, and of course, that all important number. Call that number, and we'll be happy to give you some information how to get it. And you'll be able to get your copies in Fontana Pharmacies Island wide. Another episode of Divine Encounter. Join us again next week. Same place, same time.